All right, how do you update your firmware on your XR mixer? In my case, it's the XR16, but this was the same process for the XR12, XR18, and perhaps the XR32. I don't know. Anyway, you go to Behringer.com, and you go down to Downloads over here on the left. Downloads. And... I think you go to software right there. And uh, and you type in this program called, uh, what is it? Hold on. It's called XR Edit. You search that and you'll download XR Edit. Then you gotta download the firmware. I guess you'll type in XR16 or whatever yours is, and eventually you'll find the firmware. And uh, download the firmware. And I go, I go to download, then you go to your downloads folder. There's the XR edit. Right there, it'll unzip automatically. Okay, I'm not connected, but you go. I don't go to my Wi-Fi and connect to my XR16 like you normally do. And then you go to setup. I think it's connected. Yeah, this is not connected. So let me. Okay, it's connected to the XR16. You go to setup. This wants me to connect. I'm gonna hit connect. And then this you click um, mixer to PC. It'll load all your settings. Because my show is already on the XR16 and it loads the show in there. You can see that's my show. It's a uh, Ridge Road and Mod Squad. We basically use the same show. And it's, that's my vocal and uh, Miko's vocal is there. David vocal. They have the same kind of microphone, so it sounds the same. And Chris, you know, with all the settings where Chris's monitor has got stuff. What's cool is it shows the EQ up there, too. That's neat. Anyway, you go to setup. We're going to load the firmware into the mixer. And you hit update firmware and you go to your downloads folder where you downloaded it from behringer.com and there's the update right there 1.22 hit open transferring data <laughs> I've already updated it I guess I'm doing it again okay Firmware update, 100%. Device will reboot now. I don't see my device rebooting. But anyway, that's how you um, update the firmware. And you go to setup and connect. Mixer to PC. It'll load my parameters. Should be the same because I already loaded them. Okay, there it is. It's connected up there. And it should be firmware 1.22. We'll check that. Anyway. Yeah, firmware 1.22 down there, current firmware, so I update the firmware. But this is a cool program. Uh, now, the newer, my newer tablets and phones will not download the XR app on my Samsung devices. But the Music Station app works, so I'm going to start using the Music Station app. Thank you guys.